What's going on YouTube? You're watching Fixed by Shaq and in this quick video, I'm going to show you how to lock any iPhone application individually, okay? And in order to access the application, all you need to do is just unlock your phone with Face ID, fingerprint, or type the passcode every time you try to access a particular application. This is a very, very simple process and do not worry because this works on any iPhone model, okay? In my case, I'll be using my iPhone 12 Pro Max just to showcase to you guys how it actually works, but do not worry because this works on any iPhone model, okay? Locking any application on your iPhone is very important, especially if you have sensitive information in your phone especially in situations where you for example lend your phone to someone to click your picture and the person suddenly decides to swipe up and get access to your phone i know how annoying it is and in this video i'll show you how to lock any sensitive and private application on your phone so that nobody can actually gain access to it now moving into the tutorial the very first thing you need to do is open up this application called shortcuts right here okay so this is an application that normally comes installed by default on your iPhone device but if you find a hard time finding the application do not worry simply search okay for shortcuts and see if you have the application installed if you do not have the application installed do not worry all you need to do is just open up App Store real quick and then search for shortcuts right here and then you'll be able to find the application right here and all you need to do is just tap here on open or get in order to download the application and get it installed in your iPhone device. So once you've got the application installed into your device and you've got the application opened, the next thing we need to do is tap here on automation tab real quick. And then this screen is gonna pop up and then we need to tap here on create personal automation okay so we're basically creating a lock screen so that nobody can access into our private application next up we're going to scroll down and search for app okay so we need to tap here on app tap once on app and then you need to tap here on choose in order to choose the application you wish to lock so over here you can select multiple applications according to your desire but in my case i'll be selecting one application only which is going to be instagram for example i want to lock my instagram application so that every time someone tries to access my instagram application it's going to ask me to type in my passcode or it's going to ask for my fingerprint or my face in order to unlock through face id so once we select instagram we're going to tap here on done and then make sure that we've got here a tick on is open okay and not here is closed it needs to be here on is opened next up we're gonna tap here on next and then we need to tap here on add action okay once you tap on add action we're gonna tap here on search for apps or actions and then we're gonna search for timer okay so once you find timer in here, we're gonna select start timer. And then by default, it suggests five minutes, but we're gonna change this to one second because we do not want five minutes, we want one second, okay? So simply tap here on minutes, change it to seconds, and then simply type number one because we want one second. Next up, tap here on next, and then this new page is gonna show up and make sure you turn off this option which says ask before running, okay? This is very important. Make sure you guys turn it off and tap on don't ask, okay? And then make sure that also the second new option is also turned off which says notify when run. Make sure you turn that off and this is how it needs to be set up. Next up, simply tap here on done and our automation has now been created. Now, the next thing we're gonna do is basically close the shortcuts application and then we need to open up the clock application. My clock application is right here, but if you find a hard time finding your clock application, do not worry, simply open up the search bar and then simply type in clock application and you've got in here clock application being suggested already but okay let me open up my clock application and then we're gonna tap here on 
timer okay we're gonna tap on timer and then we need to tap here where it says when timer ends okay this is very important it's a very important step in order to start locking any application so tap on when timer ends and then simply scroll down all the way down and then you're gonna find here an option which says stop playing okay so you want to tap on stop playing and then you want to tap here on set okay so once that's done we're now ready to go let's test our instagram app to see if it's gonna lock okay so i want to open up instagram let me tap on instagram and as you guys can see boom the application is now locked and in order to unlock it i need to use either my face id or my passcode okay so here we go i've just used my face id and let me for example try to close the application and then try to open up the application once again here we go boom it's locked and i need to unlock using my face id or my passcode okay so let me type in my passcode real quick boom here we go it has now unlocked again okay so this is the trick here we go closing the application once again open up instagram it gets locked every time you try to access your instagram application unfortunately we do not have an official way of locking applications from apple side because they haven't provided us yet but i wish apple provides us an official way of locking applications as soon as possible at the moment this is the only way to lock applications which is by tweaking around and finding a few shortcuts in order to get your application locked and this is the easiest and quickest way of doing it i hope you really enjoyed this video and make sure you like the video and leave a comment down below if you find my content useful here on youtube and do not forget to subscribe to the channel in order to get more tech hacks and fixes. Thank you so much for watching Fixed by Shaq and I'll see you in the next one. Have a great day.